in, guys. Ugh, I don't think it's gonna work. I don't think I'm gonna be able to show you guys. Darn it. Look, hold on. Being a supportive mama, I'm watching my daughter do her Halloween makeup. Check her out. If you're not, why not? And I also use that shade. Okay, hold on. This is my second little critter of the day. I'm missing because my husband's got the umbrella in the way. Okay, okay, now I can show you guys. Come on, camera, go fast. Check it out. Do you guys see his back? My mom's gonna be so happy. Chipper! Isn't that so cute? We had like a bird sitting there today. Yeah, anyways, just needed to share. Hey guys, and welcome back to the vlog. Look at this. Who is she? Miss Consistent. We don't know her. Yes, we do. <laughs> Here she is. Okay, guys, so here is the dealio. Um, I told you guys that I thought I was going to be doing a little bit of cooking and showing you guys. Well, <laughs> I did not. News flash. I think you guys already know. Anyways, my HelloFresh order, order la, 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 just arrived and I put it away, but I have the cards to show you guys. Um, like I said before, I always like to hear y'all's feedback on some of your favorite meals. The one that I did last night was one that you guys had actually recommended from my beauty channel, and that was a meatloaf. And it was good. Um, it, it was pretty tasty, actually. Um, but today, I let my youngest little one pick out what we're going to have. And today, I will be making the chicken and bacon ravioli and parm cream sauce. This looks delicious. Can I just tell you guys, like, quick little review on the HelloFresh. No, I'm not sponsored or affiliated or anything like that. They don't know I exist um, at all or that I have channels. One thing that really shocked me about the HelloFresh is the fact of the portions. I was really surprised that the portions that you do get are actually, like, sustainable. Is that the right word? They're, they're actually like good size. They fill you up. You don't want more. I thought it was going to be one of those things where I'm like, um, still starving and I'm going to be raiding the cabinets. I don't have that issue. There's some nights we actually have leftovers as well. So I don't know. I was pretty pleased. Like last night with the, the meatloaf, and it was meatloaf, green beans, and mashed potatoes. And we had some mashed potatoes left over and Haley stopped by and I gave her some of the mashed potatoes. So yeah, and like I told you guys in the past, I have yet to have a meal that my kids didn't enjoy. They're really liking it. So I'm pretty happy about that. Some of the other meals, I went ahead and did five meals because what I typically do is I do Sunday to Thursday typically, or no, 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 I'm sorry. Monday, I do Monday to Thursdays is how I do it because that's when we're like the busiest, obviously. Um, so then what I do, my order comes in on Tuesday. So I, I, what meal you would have for like a Friday, I skip it and use it for Monday. You see what I'm saying? So Monday through Thursday are Hello Fresh meal. I don't know if that made sense. Anywho, so this week we also got the Southwest Chicken Sausage and Rice Skillet. I've never tried this out, but again, it looked pretty good and my kids aren't picky, so I'm happy about that, you know? Um, then I also picked up the Cheesy Chipotle Barbecue Quesadillas, which I thought looked so delicious. These are all new recipes for us. We haven't we haven't done any repeats just yet. I think because we're pretty new. I want to say this was maybe our fourth week of HelloFresh. This is the Santa Fe Pork Tacos. Doesn't that look delicious, guys? Like, delicious. And, again, the portions are crazy. Like, I thought it would be, like, tiny little, like, bird portions, but it's not. It's good. Um, when you pick pasta, you guys, we always have a ton of leftovers. Like, it ends up feeding probably eight people 
to be honest with you guys like it literally they give you a good amount of pasta so we always have leftovers on that which is really nice so this is the sun-dried tomato and basil spaghetti so this will be one i think i'm gonna hold back and i'll have like next monday because like i said every tuesday my new shipment comes in and um what i typically do is i typically get like four meals but like i said if if there's some extra like meals that we like then i'll add that but believe it or not i've actually saved on our grocery bill i know i've told you guys this before and a lot of people don't believe it they're like that's really expensive and i'm like but if you knew how i was shopping before <laughs> it's really not you know and it's so much easier and like I told you guys in probably like the last couple of vlogs when I talk about HelloFresh it's just been so nice because you know I'm literally making one meal and that is it and it's it's just so nice so anyways I'm gonna hop off I got some editing to do for this channel and on my other channel I am gonna catch back up with you guys because um, I think the hubs and I are gonna go out um, with my boy and look at some used cars uh, we are on the hunt for um, a good affordable used car for my 16 year old you know that gets them from A to B um, in a safe manner and I was so annoyed we just drove like 30 minutes away to look at this one where it was looked really nice I should have known I should have known it was a too good to be true situation but um, we drove out we looked at it you guys it was so banged up it did not even look like it on the internet at all and i should have known i should have known and the guy came out i'm like what happened to your kia it was a kia ultima alt not ultima i don't know it started with an o whatever the kia o sounding one was it was like a 2009 and I'm like what happened to it and he's like what do you mean I was like that's not what it looks like on your on your website like it doesn't look like it it literally looks like someone fell asleep at the wheel and drove it down a guardrail and just you know what I mean it was a mess and honestly I don't know how any type of car company can sell a car with tires that don't even look like they're road worthy I kid you not I kid you not there was next to no tread in these tires um one tire looked like part of the rubber on it was peeling and i'm like like it, that can't be legal it can't be legal i mean it was in a in an area where i'm, I'm pretty sure it wasn't legal but i think people were turning blind eyes to things you know what i'm saying so i was like okay well no so we left it was one of those things where i don't think any car you bought off that lot was going to be you'd be lucky if it if it made it off the lot you know what i mean so i don't know so we're gonna look around and um hopefully come up with something but kentucky the way kentucky works is you get your permit and then you have to get so many hours and um my whole thing is I'd rather him get hours in a car that he becomes comfortable with. So when he has to take his actual driver's test, it's a car he's comfortable with, you know? So that that's kind of like my thought process on it as well. So we shall see. I'll probably take you guys around and you guys can check it out with us. So, And if you guys have any input on safe, safe affordable used cars that you recommend for like a 16 year old that you guys know are, are very like dependable leave me comments down below um like i said we came across across the kia uh, the kia i was kind of leaning more towards to to toyotas everyone makes fun of the way i say it so i'm trying, trying to say it correctly um and hondas but those are expensive <laughs> you guys look i'm like my god it's over 10 years old how can it be that much yeah so anywho i will catch you guys in a bit today we are looking for brothers cars I'll anything else camera goes on me I'm no I'm you just, you just, anyways girl shut the freak up love peace and anyways. happiness anyways
getting the gas right now, and then we're gonna go to some. Oh, you have a gas oh my bad. Thanks. Thanks for eat. Anyways, guys, yes, she is correct. We are shopping. Oh, thanks, honey. Oh, thanks, honey. We're getting gas, and we are looking for his car. You really don't want to? Yeah, I'm just. Oh, you're just messing? Okay, say hi. And then after that, we're gonna go to Grater's and get some ice cream. Yay! Yay! <laughs> okay, that is all. Yay! Okay, so they're closed, but... Oh, right. <laughs> they decided to walk and check hey guys, it out. guys, and welcome to the vlog. No, my... No, I'm not ready yet. <laughs> I'm not ready. Anyways, um... We did not find anything last night as far as the car search went, but I will tell you what, the graders was absolutely amazing. The end. Um, I've got some, <laughs> I've got some more things to unbox for you guys because you guys know my shopping is done via internet. So things are arriving. I did get a PR box from a new subscription company called uh, Luxily, Luxy? Is it, wait, Lux? Luxly, I think. I don't know. Beauty box. So L U X E L Y Luxly is that how you would say it. So I need to do a video on that. I have not opened it because I like to uh, be surprised on stuff. Um, but I've got some other stuff, and I thought, why not unbox it for you guys? Uh, you guys know I have a huge obsession when it comes to Bang Energy drinks, and I actually found this company, which I already took the stuff downstairs, but it's called tigerfitness.com you guys um i got a 12 pack of my bang energy drinks for 23 dollars and change and free shipping and that's not normal so i was excited about that i will link tigerfitness.com down below for you guys if you want some of your bang energy drinks as i do i lost my phone i just heard it ding oh here it is i'm i'm just so together Okay, can we can we rant, vent? This whole, like, I, I get it. I get voting is important, okay? I get that. But you know what drives me crazy? Hold on, let me get you guys situated. What drives me absolutely insane crazy is I don't know how some of these people get my, um, my cell phone number. But listen to this text. I get, I don't, I don't even know how many texts a day that I get. And of course, I don't click nothing, which this isn't a clickable one. It says, hi princess. First of all, I I'm sorry, but you done messed up because I'm the queen. <laughs> Sassy pants are engaged. Hi princess, I'm Britt with Democrats. I'm excited to cheer on Kamala Harris in the VP debate tonight, 9 p.m. Will you be watching too? I don't know who you are first of all Brit I don't know how you got my number and I'm pretty sure that like I am on like this no spam thing but yet these mother truckers keep spamming me with all this crazy stuff I can't tell you how many times they've called me princess they've called me Mario they've called me Edward and I'm like obviously you really truly don't care what I'm doing because you can't even get my name right but I do want to give like a little public service announcement. I'm deleting all of this, by the way. Um, you guys have to be careful because there is a thing going around. And I'm pretty sure it sounds legit, so I'm going to roll with it. There's this thing around where people... My son is gaming. Sorry, guys. People are getting text messages with links. And it's like, drop 50 pounds and, you know, whatever. It's like everything that we want in life. But, like, we also want sugar. So, 50 pounds dropping is not going to happen anytime soon for me. Um, but anywho, they, um, send this link hoping you'll click on it and it's actually like the, I don't want to get, um, not monetizer. So it starts with an, it ends with an trafficking. Yeah. You don't click it. So I've already done told all my children and stuff like that. Like I, I don't do it. Don't, don't don't click anything because somehow they're able to put some sort of tracker supposedly on your phone so just be super duper uber cautious period okay so that's what i started to tell you guys tiger fitness 
Bang Energy drinks. It is less expensive than if you go to um, like GNC. Also, by the way, <laughs> I got a Walmart order in. I'm gonna open some of the other stuff for you guys. Uh, they've got their um, mouthwash. Two of these, I think it was like $5 or something like that. So, hold on, let me tell my boy to stop screaming. Okay, there we go. So, really good deal on that. My youngest daughter has retainers and so that's what she uses to clean them. Um, let's open this package right here. This is from Pat McGrath. I'd love to sit here and tell you guys it's PR. It's not, I paid for it, but that's fine. Okay, so this is the brand new Holy, you know what, thank you Pat McGrath Labs for knowing how to properly package eyeshadow palettes. I appreciate that. I really do. Where are my scissors? How did I lose my scissors? I am losing my mind. Okay, here we go. Oh, okay. So this is what it looks like. The box. This is just the box. Oh my god, I like how it opens. Well, look at that. Ooh, okay. So this is the front. It is in a cardboard type of packaging. And on the back, it has all the names. I love that. I love, love, love that. Okay, ready? Oh. Pat McGrath. Ooh, I like this packaging. These are really pretty colors. This is her first palette that she's ever done with this one style packaging with this amount of shadows. Now, my understanding, these are none of her, like, um, special formula eyeshadows, but I don't really care because I love them all. It's kind of weird, though. I've got, like, a some sort of, like, marking over here. I don't know. But I'm excited. I will definitely be playing around with this. Love it so much. Thank you to myself. Yeah. But one day, baby, one day, I'll hit the PR jackpot with Pat McGrath Labs and Natasha Donona. <laughs> okay, moving on. We've got, okay, this is proof that your girl where is my flipping scissors how do i lose things that fast it's literally in the vicinity somewhere i know it is hold on guys <sighs> all sort of vicinity okay so this is proof that i do my shopping online you saw mouthwash you guys ready to see this this is from costco and didn't this look, this looks so pretty, <laughs> doesn't it? <laughs> it is the Downy Infusions Calm Lavender and Vanilla Bean. You know, I use dryer balls at, with um, essential oils and I like it, don't get me wrong. But here's the dealio. This is why I felt the need to go back and get some of this because I am very particular about my family's clothes. I don't throw everything into the dryer. One, because sometimes it gets like those little balls on there. Uh, two, because it can shrink. Three, because I'm literally that about our clothes. I want them to last forever. So one of the things that I miss is when you can't put things in the dryer, I was always using like a fabric softener so our clothes still had some sort of fresh scent to them, which they get when they're in the dryer with the dryer balls from Amazon, which if you guys follow me over my beauty channel, I did like a whole things that I love from Amazon and I talked about these wool dryer balls. So let's smell this. That smells so nice. That's, a, look at me. I'm like, here guys, give it a sniff. They need smell of vision YouTube, you should work on that. So yeah, I ordered it from Costco. It shipped to my house in two days. Love that for us. Moving right along, this is an order. This order, it, again, this was uh, one of those deals in my Amazon group on Facebook. Uh, when I go in, man, I go in hard. Um, this is 
ridiculous that my son gets that into his games but anywho um this is the snuggle super fresh these were two dollars and 99 cents you guys just go to your facebook page like if you don't have facebook you don't need it to like keep up with all the bs drama of the politics people are doing over there it drives me i'm just like okay everybody's got their own opinion it's it's cool i i don't i it's just not my forte to like get all crazy in the comment section but maybe that's just me because I, I don't know I just don't so anyways go to Facebook look for Amazon groups you guys like I said two dollars and ninety nine cents this is for 30 loads this one is snuggly fresh odor eliminating technology I guess it's just called super fresh so let's sniffer yeah mmm they, these both smell really good. So I bought three of them because, you know, $2.99. I felt like that was a better deal even, like, sometimes you can find, like, the little mini versions of the Dollar Tree. But I don't leave my house. So I felt like that was a good deal. So there's that. I don't, this is a judgment-free zone over here too, guys. So I don't want to hear about it. I'm happy at home. Okay, so this next item is actually from Walmart. I ordered three and they sent me two that's a little worrisome we'll see this is just a black like feely good shirt type of dealio like one of those dry things that my son had asked for and we happened to have gone into oh my god what is on my nail I just polished them and they're got like funk on them um but he was asking for just a plain black long sleeve shirt and they were sold out of his size so found it online because that's the way to shop okay we've got some more amazon packages oh my gosh you guys you know what i forgot to do i forgot to show you guys this other little techie thing i got off of amazon it's like the gadget you didn't know you needed i've got in my kids bathroom for their toothbrushes one of those ultraviolet germ killers because your girl's a germaphobe period pre-kona krona kona pre-corona i was still is it corona coronavirus yeah COVID. Rona, whatever. Pre-Rona, I was like always a germaphobe. That's just me. And um, anyways, I came across, I don't know where I was going with that. Anyways, I came across these UV toothbrush killers um, and it hangs up on their wall and they can just put their toothbrushes in there and it kills it and it's amazing. So I found one for me where it's just like goes over top of your toothbrush. Coolest little thing ever. I'll try and remember to link it down below for you guys if you're interested. Don't worry, these have all been cleaned. Oh my gosh, check it out. So if you guys saw my last video, I was talking about these little sequin pumpkins to go with my fall decor of Amazon thingies that I got. So these came in, they actually came in a couple days ago, but how cute are these? These are definitely like a foam plasticky feeling. That's two different kinds of things. Well, just by the feel through the plastic, it feels, it feels like foam, so cool. Okay, moving on to our next Amazon goodie purchases. Oh, okay, this is for my youngest daughter. She needed a um, royal blue long sleeve shirt. So, you know, what better place to find it than Amazon? Love that for us I'm telling you. There's no point into even going in stores, guys. Like, oh, oh. Random question of the day, what do you think Black Friday is going to be like? Because I'm hoping that we're going to get even more amazing deals since pretty much everybody stays at home like me. Right? Or is it just me? It's probably just me. <laughs> okay, here's another thing I got because I need... Okay, here's the dealio, guys. When I got my divorce, um, I got a lot of hand-me-down type of um pots and pans which is fine i i don't i don't mind that i was a struggling single mom so i was gifted some very affordable pots and pans which worked and um it's it's been like 13 years since my divorce and i thought you know what sis it's kind of time to get you some nice things because no longer do the things that were like um what do they call that non-stick 
or whatever, yeah, it now sticks. Like everything sticks. Unless you use like a gallon of oil or a stick of butter, it's sticking. So I did a little research and they said Rachel Ray pots and pans are supposed to re be really good and like safe, no chemically stuff. So Walmart had a sale on the set of Ra Rachel Ray things. So I wanted pink. You guys know that, but they didn't. They didn't have pink. Um, so I just went with this like slate gray, whatever, because it matches everything. And these seem like really pretty. I gotta throw everything in the dishwasher. But it was a set. It was regularly like 160 bucks, and it was on sale at Walmart for 99 dollars. So I went ahead and got it. And like I said, it was supposed to be from what I saw online. Um, not only is it durable, it's a Rachel Ray porcelain cookware, durable non-stick performance, but it doesn't have all those, um, bad for you chemicals and stuff. So that is my little haul that I have for you guys. I have another box, but I also have one of my littles, um, uh, be bopping around and some of it's our Christmas stuff. So I don't want to show you guys. So Anyways, that is going to be all for this vlog. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I love doing hauls. I love watching hauls. I have been watching um, people people's haul videos from like December of 2019. You like getting ideas for Christmas. Because you guys know your girl is like ready for Christmas. Like November 1 rolls around. The Christmas tree is going up. It's a fala la la holla mother trucking day. Because I am over the Rona. And... I enjoy fall, but like the Christmas tree is just my happy place. I love to walk down and see the tree and I'm just like, mm. so anyways, guys, that is all for today's vloggy video. I hope you guys are enjoying these. Um, I think for the longest time I just felt bad because like before I stayed at home, but I still kind of went out here and there, but now that's pretty much all I do is stay at home, um, which I'm okay with, but I feel like I bore you guys. So but you guys say don't. So here you are. Here you are. Sitting in front of my front door. Just unboxing stuff. Because that's that's the Rona life. <laughs> and the social anxiety awkward life. Okay guys. I'm hopping off for now. Until next time as always. I hope you have a wonderful, beautiful, and blessed day. Kisses from Kentucky. Mwah!